also from the night team. Story of a local man. Does he have a special gift? Is what he does a miracle? That man is from Marshfield. He holds healing services all across the country. And there's certainly no shortage of people who say their lives have been changed because of this man named Frank Kelly. Seven's Amanda Grace introduces us to the man many say brings miraculous healing and hope. He's a Marshfield man who travels the country to pray with thousands of people. Can't peace, got peace now. But many say Frank Kelly is doing more than praying. He's actually healing them. Keep that peace now, okay? Hugh Trainer of Malden says he experienced Frank's gift firsthand. Trainer was set to go on a once-in-a-lifetime trip to Italy when a health scare threatened to change his plans. It was the Sunday before we left for Rome. And he says, I can't even walk. I'm in so much pain. Trainer had seen doctors for arthritis in his knee before, but his condition became unbearable. My left knee actually was swelled up the size of a basketball. Until he turned to Frank and his healing prayers. I got out of the chair and I finally realized my knee was perfectly normal. I was so stunned they couldn't even think. When I pray with the people, they put, they experienced peace. Frank Kelly says he was not born with the gift of healing. He grew up in a devout Boston Catholic family, but he says he didn't discover his gift until after a nearly fatal accident 25 years ago. He was shocked with a potentially lethal dose of electricity. Frank says during his recovery, he was visited by Jesus. It was then, he says, he was called to help others. And since then, people have been flocking to him like they did at this healing service in Halifax. When I do meet people, all I gently ask, all I want to know is their first name, and I pray with them. I think the electrocution certainly did something to him. I think it changed him in a certain way. Father Ronald Ticelli, a Jesuit priest and professor at Boston College, is Frank's spiritual advisor. Believe me, I try all sorts of natural explanations, but there's no question in my mind that God himself is doing some serious work here. And many agree. In this book written about Frank called Short Circuit to God, there are pages and pages of testimonials like these. Six months after I met Frank, I sustained a painful back injury. He prayed over me and believed Jesus would heal me. Frank encouraged me to pray and trust. I began to recover. He put his hands over my head and asked me if there were any physical problems. I mentioned my wrist. He prayed over me. My wrist pain seemed much better. Over the next few weeks, it disappeared. Pain healed and lives changed for the people who say Frank is nothing short of a miracle. I think it's divine intervention that comes through. Amanda Grace, 7 News. So Frank Kelly says he never solicits the people he helps that they find him. If you'd like more information on Frank Kelly or you'd like to find out about one of these healing services, you can get that on our website at whdh.com. I think everybody likes to believe in a miracle. Yeah, and some people may say they need a little bit more science to back it up. Still fascinating to hear about.